act of goodwill and the desire to help others never goes unrewarded. There are different kinds of philanthropists, but they can primarily be divided into two buckets. Those who give money and those who give them money and time to affect change on the ground. Our second award is for the category Best Grassroots Philanthropist. And to tell you more about it, let's hear from jury member Rajat Dhawan, managing partner at McKinsey India. Forbes India Leadership Awards. While uh, discussing uh, all the worthy nominees uh, in the category of uh, grassroots philanthropists, we actually uh, took a look at a couple of lenses. Firstly, we were very keen to see uh, who has gone beyond the scope of just doing mandated CSR. Um, so we, we looked at uh, who has really been contributing a substantial portion of their net worth towards creating real social impact. Um, and second, we tried to recognize uh, systematic, strategic, and sustained philanthropy over a period of time uh, that has been direction setting uh, in the respective spheres. So again, it was, uh, it was to go beyond the check the box CSR. Uh, and our jury was very clear that as we recognize the winner, um, we wished uh, that the winner could become an even more prominent flag bearer uh, for the critical role uh, the change makers play through giving and uh, through being ambassadors of how their roles uh, create a significant effect on family, on community life, as well as on future generations. Uh, for me, it was uh, truly inspiring to deliberate on this category with my fellow jury members and our collective gratitude to all the nominees. Forbes India Leadership Awards. And the Best Grassroots Philanthropist Award goes to Rohini Nilekani, Chairperson of the Rohini Nilekani Philanthropies. Rohini Nilekani has been consistently supporting a number of urgent and even unconventional social causes with her personal wealth and time. She leads by example to uphold domestic philanthropy, creating linkages between civil society, the government, and markets. We congratulate Ms. Nilekani. Unfortunately, she couldn't join us this evening, but she did send us a little message. Forbes India Leadership Awards. Namaste, everyone. I'm delighted and honored to be selected as the Grassroots Philanthropist of the Year. Indian philanthropy is at a very exciting stage now, I do believe. And I think many new trends, and especially the one that warms my heart the most, is that young people who are having the opportunity and the luck and the blessing to be successful early in their lives have quickly realized the responsibility of their incoming wealth and have been giving it forward very smartly and very quickly. And that makes me really happy as a new trend. I believe as we all learn to give forward better in this country, where there are still 600 million people waiting to come into the room that all of us are occupying now, to help them to create the better society that we all want to live in, we need to do a lot more. And I think one of the key words, again emerging from the past two years, is collaboration. How can we do more strategic, collaborative philanthropy together? This decade is going to be the most important human decade in terms of whether we make our planet and our country resilient to future shock. And I believe philanthropy has a huge role to play as we all learn. With all of us have much more than we need, the people in this room that I'm speaking to. How can we come together with imagination and open up our minds, hearts and pockets a little bit more? Thank you once again to the jury and to Forbes India. Namaste. Forbes India Leadership Awards.